Uh, Nigel Evans. Mr. Speaker, I, I like the idea of a happiness debate, Mr. Speaker. Um, people are so fraught around here. Nobody asks, how's your day been? They say, how bad's your day been? Uh, so I think uh, that's a great idea. Um, and Brexit is in danger, while we're trying to deliver that, of crowding out other issues. Uh, as people know, 850 people have been affected by the loan charge uh, uh, legislation uh, uh, involving £33 million. It's led to bankruptcies, it's led to breakdowns, and sadly, it's led to suicides. Is it possible to have a statement from a Treasury uh, Minister next week in order to see what changes can be made to alleviate their misery? Well, um, my honourable friend raises a really important point, and this issue has been raised with me directly by constituents of mine. What I can say to him is that there is a debate um, that's being arranged by the Backbench Business Committee to discuss this very issue with ministers, and I would encourage him to take part in that. But to his other point about Brexit squeezing out other legislation, I would just like to highlight to the House that so far this session, 51 government bills have been introduced, 43 of which have already received royal assent on important legislation ranging from counter-terrorism bill, the tenants fee bill, um, the Overseas Crime Production Orders Act and of course the Voyeurism Offences Act. Some of these things really improving the lives for all of our constituents and something we should celebrate.